Go buy coffee, coffee brand, coffee, use code RUIN at the checkout! Leon's being a misogynist. I could see us having that issue being from a bunch of people who clearly lack a fundamental understanding about how babies are made, but screw it. Let's have a fun time. Let's watch this, because apparently women should be paid to exist. Unpopular opinion, but I literally think that women should be paid to exist. Okay. I know y'all are probably gonna be like, what? No. But no, follow me on this. Follow okay, okay, I'm gonna follow you. Follow me on this. So one, like one our bodies literally create life y'all that's true like that within itself like it beats any freaking invention that a man can come up with like any tech company like no i don't know you know you have a kid but then you have a playstation 5 and i truly do believe playstation 5 means more to the culture than a child that you made that you probably didn't even want no tech company can come up with a baby in my belly so one, that's why we should get paid. Okay. Um, and then even women who, like, are, have already had children, they should still get paid because guess what? Okay. Like the life of a mother, like that's a whole job within itself. I that's true. I really think that we should receive monthly incomes for being women. I know that sounds ridiculous, but I'm being so serious. I'm being so serious. So is it just mothers who deserve that income or is it all women? Because if you're a woman living in the year 2023 in the 21st century and you just cooling, but you don't want kids, I don't think you deserve to get paid because what are you doing? You just sitting there fertile, not having kids. So, you know, I, I, I feel like I know where she's going with this just a little bit. Also, just in case anyone has never had sex, it a woman can't have a child without a man now you'll sit there and say what about going to the sperm bank guess what you gotta have a man going into the sperm bank first so guess what you're paying a woman you might as well pay a man let's go to the next one a bunch of incel men are like so i mean so upset about the video where i'm like women should be paid to exist understandable They're literally like i mean upset like pissed which like it just makes me laugh because y'all are saying women shouldn't be paid to exist Blah. i'm sorry who are the ones paying for only fans men and women they you, you, you gotta show respect to the ladies who want some only fans action who are the ones making bank on only fans it's not men. women it's, men. it's not men it's women and who are the ones paying the women men and what are the women just doing? Honestly, they're just existing in their, in their bodies that y'all are choosing to sexualize. So. Oh, uh, uh, whoa, 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 hold on, madam. I don't know about that one. I don't think it's just, I don't think little, uh, what's her name? What's a woman's name? I don't know. I've never seen a woman today in my life. Uh, Sabrina. You know, my Sabrina's out there. Leave me alone. But imagine Sabrina just existing. You know, she's just reading a book. You know, nothing going on. She's fully clothed. You know what I'm saying? That lady's not getting a lot of money on OnlyFans. Now imagine a woman named Katie. Katie's reading a book too. But Katie got some lingerie on. Mm. Katie got some nice little spandex on. Mm. Katie got her nipples showing. Mm. Katie is doing a little bit more than just existing in her body. She's putting on a show for everybody and everybody's gonna go for it because horniness makes some money. And side note, and I know this is going to upset some of you people who claim to be real alpha men, but doing podcasts where you promote these women and sit there and say, oh, well, see, the modern women are all evil is part of the reason why they're making money because they go on these popular podcasts, they got their titties all perked up and they look all cute and people say, I want to see that. Now, apparently, she's continued to go on her crusade against the men who have criticized the points she's made over these coming TikToks. And you know, Let's see what she got to say. The amount of men who actually secretly hate women is actually next level. I made the video where I say that women should be paid to exist. Bro, the amount of men who are like, well, us men contribute to human life too. Well, no shit. No shit. Thank you for stating the obvious. Thank you, Captain Obvious. Like, no shit men contribute to life. But you guys don't contribute in the same way. You guys literally give a nut and leave. Hey, 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 madam. 
them two minutes was hard on me. Like, calm down. This is ridiculous. That nut, that nut was worth it. You're not getting that baby. Ergo, you're not getting paid to exist without them two minutes worth of a nut. What? Women, our minerals are depleted, literally. In the process of giving birth, our bone density decreases, our hair gets dry, our teeth get weaker because the babies are literally taking our minerals from our bodies to nourish that baby. On top of that, men, you do a nut. You're not stuck for nine months carrying that baby as it grows in you. You're not sick. I'm stuck with nine months dealing with you though. You're not stuck. This is, <laughs> I didn't mean it. Ladies, pregnancy is beautiful. No matter what you say, pregnancy is beautiful and it should be cherished by all who want to have children. If you don't want to have children, get a condom, get a vasectomy, get a plan B or don't have sex. Stuck with the morning sickness. You're not stuck not being able to work certain days. You're not stuck w literally with the fucking baby growing inside of you. And the amount of men who want to make it seem like it's comparable is next level. On top of that, y'all aren't the ones who have your body and your psych damaged through childbirth. It's women. There is no comparison. Yes, of course, it takes both a man and a woman for human life. Thank you. But the contributions are not the same. And trying to act like they're the same is actual delusion. Why do I agree with her? Because, you know, taking that cool little uh, 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 and putting it in her is not the same as her holding it for nine months. She's right. But. The contributions don't just stop there. You have to provide for the child. You have to nurture the child. You have to take care of the child. Put the child through school. Put the child through life. Teach the child life lessons. There's more than just a quick nut and holding the baby in your body. There's more to it. And if you just stop there, what's the point? What's the real point of having a kid? If you're just gonna stop there and be like, I deserve everything because I did this portion of the work and now I'm just talking as if I don't need to do anything else. Also for all the people who are absolutely like obsessed with questioning my intelligence because of the way I speak, because apparently if you speak a certain way that just means that you can't be book smart. I graduated from not only the top university in Texas, but the number one advertising program in America, number two in the world. Great. And I also went on to law school, so. Great. Yet I have private accounts saying, you're so fucking dumb, she's mental. Am I mental or are y'all mental for getting so worked up over a video that you don't agree with? I mean, I don't know about y'all, but if I see a video I don't agree with, I just scroll. I don't give them my energy. But I appreciate it because you guys are actually helping boost me. I've gained a lot of followers, so keep commenting, keep hating because it helps the algorithm. Oh. Dad, she's not wrong. When you spend so much time giving energy to something you're so passionately disagreeing with, you put more eyes on it that will agree with her. So, you know, I'm with her on that. And I don't even think she's dumb. I think she's just trying to make an egregious mountain out of the smallest minute molehill because she feels in her mind women deserve to exist and be paid for having a baby. And, you know, could be with you on that if the men get paid also because if they're in the household taking care of the kid, making sure the kid's stable, making sure the kid is well fed, you know, why not both of y'all get paid? Why are we sitting here making it just like, Women existing should just get money for a lifetime. Where's that money going to come from? I know where it could come from, and that's child support. But I don't sit here and think, yeah, you should be paid. You should be compensated on a weekly or monthly basis for sitting there for nine months birthing a child. You know, nothing else. Not taking care of the kid, not, not putting the kid through school, nothing else. You should just be paid for carrying the child because that is the only contribution you have to society just holding somebody's nut and developing it in your stomach for a couple months nothing else nothing else nothing else